there, it's Vicki McCarthy from Aussie Stampers. Welcome back to the most amazing card kit ever series. This is the final day of the series where I'm going to show you how to prep and how to put together the five large cards in the set of cards in the Oh Happy Day card kit that's coming in the new catalogue in June. So these are the last five cards with the components that they need and I'm going to go through and stamp them with their images and get back to you. So here I am back with the cards and I've stamped them now ready to go and one of the things that I wanted to point out to you when you're doing your cards I haven't stamped this one yet here it is ready to be stamped this image on here is going to be simply thank you whereas this image is why thank you which is lovely but on the stamp the why and the thank you are together so if I turn this around there we go you can see there's your stamp now this is a technique called masking it's really simple and if you haven't done it before super super easy all it requires is some sticky tape and all I'm going to do is actually mask off that word why with sticky tape cut a piece off my scotch tape and mask that word why with the sticky tape and then if there's another piece that's sticking out in fact you might need two pieces of tape because the W or the Y or the Y at the end of it stick out a little bit so let's see if you can see that I just mask that off with tape so the word Y is covered but the thank you is not so I'm going to stamp that into my ink pad now now the important step here <laughs> you don't want to forget this is to just pull off the sticky tape and then stamp down and you can see that only the word thank you has come out not the why so that's how you do your masking and that's going to go over onto this card over here just pop that in there so here's the card we're working from here and these are the elements that you're going to need for this card so you have your black and white spotted base you have a white piece which has embossed dots on it then there is a piece with yellow diagonal lines on it which layers on next then you have a star really pretty then you have a pale green flagged at one end piece and then you're going to have one of the gold pieces this is the medium length gold piece flagged at one end you're going to have three of the stars from the chipboard sheet pink green in the large size and the dark green in the small size you're going to have your why thank you bubble and you're going to have a length of twine now this is quite a long piece of twine and I explained in the previous videos that what I did was I cut everything on the dining room table laid it all out and whatever was left after I cut all my twine I divided into four because there are four cards that have quite a lot of twine so you can see it's quite long so this is going to wrap around behind like it does here and that goes onto the white dotted piece the white dotted piece I'm now going to adhere or you could do this in the reverse order you could do the white first adhere it onto your black and white spots if you want the next thing I'm going to do is pop up the large star on dimensionals and I've still got plenty of dimensionals left from the kit already so they're giving you plenty of dimensionals to work with here which is fantastic pop the backs off your dimensionals and then the star goes about here Next I'm going to wind this into a kind of a circle.
going to adhere that with some dimensionals, one in the centre. Just pop that on. And now attach the chipboard stars. You've got a light green, you've got pink, and a dark green, the medium size. And there's your first one finished. Now here's the next one ready to go. That's this card down here. So you need a black and white spotty base in the large size. Then you're going to have this white piece which has diagonal lines across it. Then you're going to have the largest gold banner flagged at both ends. The thank you that you previously stamped using the masking technique. You're going to have a length of twine which is 9 inches. And you're going to have the orange doily, the floral image rectangle. The yellow and white striped large flagged both ends piece. This is the large pink heart. It's the only heart that is large in the pink. Um, and there's a smaller pink one as well, but it's the large size for the pink. And then the three gems, enamel gems. Next, the orange doily. Just slightly over to the right, near the bottom. Next, your floral image rectangular piece. Fast fuse again. Next, your yellow flag, and this is where we start popping up on dimensionals. Center that. over to the right. So Tombow Multi Adhesive on the top of the pink heart. Roll it into a small ball. That goes on the lower right hand side of the pink heart and then you can pop the twine on top of that. One Two, three. The next card is the Love You card, which is this one right here. So the elements you need for this are your green diagonal base, your spotted white piece, the Love You, which has been stamped to the right side, Again, a large amount of the twine that's left over, one of those long pieces. The floral image that has these two little buds here in a pale green. And some of the orange, three of the orange enamel pieces. Get some fast fuse. The next thing is your string. Now this, I'm just going to not even put in a circular shape. I'm just going to randomly let it fall how it does. But before I do that, I want to get the kinks out with my bone folder. Next comes the Love You. This is going out slightly over to the right. Now some fast fuse on the floral piece. And the three orange coloured enamel pieces. One, two, three. Now here's the fourth card. 
The base for this is a floral. The layering piece is the spotted white rectangle. There is an outlined green heart, a punched out piece of orange circle with a heart in the centre that's been punched out. These just pop out when you take the kit apart. A large black and white striped banner flagged at both ends. The star that we stamped on with the word hello. Two gold hearts, the small ones. And two white hearts. And nine inches of twine. Now you're probably wondering where the white hearts come in. These are actually going to be stamped with black spots. So use this little stamp down here with the black and white spots. So there are our two stamped using the heart stamp. Last views on the white rectangle. Fast views on the black diagonal flag. And that goes about two thirds of the way down, centered. Next, I'm going to glue the heart outline over here using Tombow Multi Adhesive. Next, the orange circular piece with the heart popped out of the centre. Now the small pink chipboard heart. This is the dark pink heart. Next, the black stamped heart. The second black stamped heart. The small gold heart in foil. Just add the glue to the outline. And the second gold foil heart. Pop up the hello star with some dimensionals and finally a bow with a twine. So here's the final card. It's this card right here. So for this you're going to need the orange spotted base, a diagonal stripe layering white piece, another one of the rectangles with the florals, the line. Plenty of twine again. The gold flagged banner that's flagged on one end. The black and white striped smaller flagged banner that's flagged on one end. The yellow star from the chipboard packet. That's one of the medium sized stars. And the three green enamel glittery elements. And of course the yay which you stamped out before. You start by adhering your white piece with fast views. Next your floral rectangle. Fast views on the black and white flagged piece. and on the gold piece. I'm going to put the gold just under the black and white. Next, the black and white goes on the top. Fast views on the yay. And adhere that on the right hand side. Next, the orange heart. Use your Tombow Multi Adhesive for the yellow star from your chipboard. And finally, the green sparkly 
enameled elements. One, two, three. So there are your final cards in the most amazing card kit ever using the Oh Happy Day card kit. Now I'm going to bring in the entire suite for you to see. So here are some of the cards and here are the rest coming in. So this is a wonderful suite of cards. I hope you enjoyed this project. I look forward to seeing you again next time. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you give the Oh Happy Day card kit a try. Bye for now.